Hi, everybody, and welcome again to Z-Code Sports System. Here we developed automated system to help you win big every time. It doesn't matter what sport you're betting on. We've got you covered. So before we get into some NHL action for March the 18th, I want to invite you to join so you'll have access to the VIP club section, which, again, has all of these tools to help you make your picks. Okay, it's a light schedule in the NHL for a Monday. It's only two games, but um, it's getting closer to the end of the season. 80% of the schedule is in, so every game is important. So we're going to take a look at both of these uh, contests for uh, March the 18th. Washington at Calgary. Washington comes in uh, average status, uh, winners of three out of their last six, and they're coming off of a 2-1 to one win over Seattle. Uh, Calgary is ice cold up, coming off of a win. They're two, just 2-4 two and four over their last six, but their last one was a nice 4-1 to one win over Vegas, so let's see if that gets them back on the right track. The score prediction for this contest is Washington 4, Calgary 3, but the score prediction has a confidence of only 23%. If we take a look at the over-under, the teams have been involved in games mainly, uh, may, uh, excuse me, mainly over the line in the last 12, but under the line recently. As far as what the teams have been doing uh, home and road on the season, uh, Calgary is 17-15-1 at home, and Washington is 14-15-4 on the road. If you take a look at the stability factor, how consistent are they with their favorite underdog stats, you see kind of an up and downward trend. It was upward for a while, but over the last uh, couple months, both teams have been like an, on an upward and downward trend with this uh, category. Washington 9, Calgary 7, which means they're moderately consistent with regard to their favorite underdog status. If you look at the head-to-head -head matchup between the two teams back on October 16th and the only meeting between the two teams, Washington won 3-2 to two as a home underdog. And if we take a look at the power ranks indicator, see Washington on a little bit of upward climb lately to up to plus 15, while Calgary has been on a downward trend over the last week from plus 9 down to plus 2. So in the end, I think this is going to be a good chance for Calgary to even the, the score for the season series. I think they will win this game by one goal, and I'm picking this one to be high scoring, so let's go over the line. Then we got Buffalo and Seattle, two teams heading in opposite directions. You see Buffalo winners of their last three games, burning hot, and they have outscored their opponents 14-5 to in those three, while Seattle is ice cold down, losers of their last three, and really uh, not playing very good at, at all in those games. They did play decently in, in the uh, Vegas game, losing at home in overtime, but the other two games only scoring one goal total. If you take a look at the over-under, both teams have been involved in games evenly over and under over in, during the last six contests. So this would be one to avoid betting the over-under most likely. Uh, the score prediction has Buffalo 4, Seattle 3, with confidence in the prediction a little bit less than a toss of a coin at 49%. As far as the teams going for the season, uh, home and road, you can see that Seattle is 14, 13, and 6 at home, while Buffalo is... 15, 13, and 4 on the road. On the power ranks indicator, Buffalo on the upward trend over the last week from, from 13 up to 20, while Seattle has been on a downward, uh, you know, like falling off of a 13 down to 1 over the last five days. Head to head back on January the 9th, and the only meeting between the teams this season, Seattle won easily. Uh, on the road, as a road underdog, 5-2 is to a really an impressive game. The volatility oscillator, the stability factor, you can see not very consistent with regard to the third underdog status. You see here, this is uh, Seattle. They were up to plus 8 back on uh, January 24th and as recently as February the 12th. But since then, very inconsistent, and they are now at plus 3 in that category. And you can see Buffalo up and down all season, they are at plus 4. The teams are just moderately consistent, so I would take the feared underdog stats with a grain of salt in this one. Um, in the end, I think this is going to be uh, a Buffalo victory. Not by much. I say a single goal. Um, I like Buffalo, but I'm going to pass on the over-under bet in this one. So there you have it. Those are the two games for the NHL for March the 18th. Happy betting. Enjoy the weekend, and we will see you next time.